Tyco. Nick! I get to be the bad guys. You get to be the bad guys this time. The mustache Wait, twirling. You've always evil. been the bad guys. Wait, <laughs> that is not true. I've always viewed myself as the good guys I'm defending their land. It's all matter of perspective. It's all that's matter true. from a certain point. But of not view. this time. This time, no. This time I am unobjectively the bad guys. The bad guys? Okay. The most unique race in fantasy I think I have ever seen. The Spire. They are aliens that rely on clone made troopers of various size to defeat their enemies. They saw how other armies were utilizing cavalry and they said, that sounds good, but we don't want to be beholden to some other beast like a horse. We'll just grow our own horses and attach them to, to clones. Perfect. It's so creepy. I'm playing objectively the good guys. I would say so. The hundred kingdoms we are going to defend of this temple. Oh, this riffraff. We will destroy them. This ancient temple that normally has just been a ruin in the desert recently has been desecrated by some unknown force. A dark omen has attracted the worried wise men of the hundred kingdoms and ambitious seekers from the spire. Restless spirits haunt this place, the fallen of terrible battles past. The shrine dedicated to soothing these lost souls has been desecrated, and the race to reinter the dead before they rise and join the Old Dominion or are robbed by callous spire operatives will be settled by conquest. The temple itself is going to be unenterable. Can't, and, go, can't go through it, gotta go around it. And will um, obscure anyone trying to shoot through it. Harder to shoot through it, got uh, it. These, we're going to play as if they are, um, you can move through them because then you can kind of you yep. can charge through them, but you can't end on. Might be able to like hide behind one, you can't end on it so I can protect myself. Get set, folks. This is going to be a tight match with no holds barred as the armies race to score the five points needed for victory in Breakthrough. So this is Breakthrough. We are attempting to score points by holding objectives. The objectives in your own territory, you can collect one victory point. Only one for holding either one of them. The enemy territories ones are worth two each. So you what mean these ones? That's the right. Enemies. Yes, exactly. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Yeah, these ones. These ones. The, 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 these ones. <laughs> right. At 1,020 points, these armies are hard-hitting elite forces with lots of upgrades. The Spire, led by a high-clone executor, to leverage the amazing supremacy ability coordinated assault, which lets the first three units in Nick's command stack act together, and the personalized epigenetic trigger army ability, which burns out his units for a high risk speed and clash buff. The greedy lineage highborn is the real powerhouse character in this army. She has a series of upgrades that push her up to 265 points, more than a quarter of Nick's forces. Her ferromantic override gives a free mover clash action to a unit nearby, a massive bonus. And she can transfer her decadent decay to foes that dare activate in her presence. Speedy Avatara accompany her while the executor is escorted by force grown drones. A regiment of brute drones and a regiment of powerful Centaur Avatara round out Nick's dynamic, hard hitting force. I am leading the hardened veterans of the Hundred Kingdoms led by a noble lord with full combat retinue and the Flesh Cleaver. His escorting Household Guard veterans with Arms Master will benefit greatly from the best of men, supremacy ability which allows them to reroll sixes to hit and sixes on their saves. Together, the noble and his guard make up over half the cost of the army. Veteran Household Knights should have no trouble operating on their own. Along for the adventure is a chapter mage with her escort of men-at-arms. While this force is small, it boasts professional defenders of honor and justice. I think they get the point. I'm looking forward to destroying you. <laughs> Let's do it. Help us make more Conquest content and join the fun by clicking the affiliate link below. Conquest is made by its community for its community, and Parabellum continues to raise the bar of excellence in game and models. A whole faction of the undead Old Dominion are available now. Check out the Living World, Discord, or Facebook groups and join in the fun. Reinforcements! Excellent, so turn one, only light things can come in. My High Clone Executor is a medium unit, however, he is in a light unit, so he's gonna come on with them. So this is a smart scoring strategy. It allows you to get a medium unit on the table in the first turn. Because light units can't actually control and score objectives. Right. They can contest them, but they cannot control them. But you're gonna sneak points. one on. Oh yeah. My entire light squad is coming in. Oh. Okay, you guys coming in? I don't. You have no light units. No light units. Oh, I'm gonna get there first. There you are. It's my board. <laughs> Let's go to Supremacy. Supremacy it is. Nice, nice. You get to go first, sir. I've gone. Your turn. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> it's the force grown drones. 
Cool. I call an executioner. He cheers loudly. Well, he finds the first trinket that, that tells him and gives him He's a clue. Like, oh, there's something here. He sees something shiny in the dirt. He reaches down and picks it up. It's an old bracelet from an officer of the Old Dominion. Fantastic. Victory phase. One point for you. Yay, winning! You're winning! Turn two! Turn two! Reinforcement phase. Excellent. I have my avatar and my brutes. On a two or less. I got one! One's coming in! I got two. So now I get to choose which guys are coming in, and I get to do that secretly. Now if I just stay here, I continue to just get one point, correct? You do. Awesome. All right, I have made my deck, sir. So have I. Supremacy. See who gets to go first. Ooh. I go first. I don't know if I actually want to go first, because we're not gonna be fighting this round. The High Cone Executor goes first, and he is digging for more trinkets. <laughs> don't try to get in my head. <laughs> don't try to get in your head. Oh, look at that wimpy unit. Man at arms. Your turn, sir. For the next one is the Force Grown Drones. Force Grown. These guys right here. I think let's move up. Yeah, let's do a double march action. Jump, 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 jump. I'm not gonna move the full 10 or 11, I guess, in this instance, because I have a banner in there. Just enough that uh, keep you away from that objective. Get off my lawn. <laughs> Household God. Well done, sir. That looks good. Um, too bad they're gonna have to die. Yes, because next I have the Avatar. They're gonna get to move seven plus seven plus one for the banner. I need to burn out these guys, giving me plus two to my march. So that means I actually move an additional four inches. So I'm actually way up here. Highborn, because they take damage separately. Fives and sixes, nothing. And I took one. One whopping wound. Completely move. worth it. Three wounds remaining on that. Coming for your Tycho. Uh-oh. My noble lord is not gonna do anything. Uh, and then uh, my linear Tarborn looks at you with disgust. So you're not gonna do another movement? The, you want me to use my once per game ability to move into flame ring? No. My chapter mage! <gasps> Darn! Just think it's out of range. Game. Almost like I planned it. I did it, I really did it. <laughs> so that looks to be the end of round two. So, you get one more point, so now it's two points for Nick, and one point for me, the noble lord consecrating the earth with holy oil as the household guard form up. I have two units that haven't come on the board. Brutes, come on! Yes! And my centaurs. One or two? Oh, so close. Can I reverse those dice rolls? No. So my centaurs are not coming in. Oh no, my knights decide Your not knights to. Are staying out. <laughs> Some brute drones, eh? <laughs> I really don't know what you're gonna do. It's interesting. While Nick is up in points, I don't think he's going to sit back and let me dictate this fight. I need to be aggressive and find a way to get him off one of his home objectives. If I move these guys a little bit closer, I could then use potentially the draw event of, of my warlord there to be able to react to what you do. I don't know if I wanna go first and try to get in there fast or wait for you so you don't flame me. It's a difficult decision right now. It is, it is. I'm glad it is. Hmm. Good for you. <laughs> I got my deck, you ready? Yep. All right, who goes first? Supremacy, lowest dice wins. Ooh. It's a tie. Oh. However, I think I have more cards than you now. So you get you get to add or plus minus to that. What do you want to do? Uh, I'm gonna let you go first. You're gonna let me go first, I'm sure you were. Okay, so the first thing is the high clone executioner who sits there and says, go forth and damage people. He just sits there and does nothing. The household god. Double march. Double march. There I am, still claiming my objective. Household guard have gone. The next one is my force grown drones. See, the problem is if I charge and I don't roll high enough, I'm basically giving up this objective. You know what? We're gonna try it. This game is about sitting back. This game is about going forward. So you're burning out? Burning out. Um, to possibly do damage to myself later, but I'm also gonna get plus two to my movement and plus one to my clash, which could be strong. Let's do it. You guys don't resist the burnout either. I know. <laughs> oh, okay, we're gonna do it. I know you're just getting into my head. I know you're just saying that because you want me to risk it. But oh God, do it anyways. On a three or higher, I charge into you. All right. Kill them all. Okay. It's a two. Not a three. Luckily, you have a yes. node of some sort. Fairmantic node. So basically, drone farts going fast. It's a five! It's a five! We're in there. Fantastic. So I move my march plus the dice to get in there and charge you. 
I may have miscalculated here, folks. I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> uh, however, I think I did fairly good save. What you do decently well at. Get the rerolls, so. I think you did really good. All right, so you're gonna take your result from the force grown drones. I'm fine. All but one. I still got a six. So four, clean one. You only save me on ones or twos. One more loss from leadership. But now I have to do something really scary. I gotta see if these guys burn out and die. There's that. Three for the character, and I take one damage. Oh! Five. That's, that's okay. Well, it says turn to try. I declare a duel, sir. But I don't have to accept. So you're broken? You are so beneath me. You're not worthy of a challenge. Oh. Secretly, he's quaking in his boots. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can actually survive that challenge. <laughs> um, and I don't want him to die because I would like a chance to do his ability. All right, so my turn. And I have activated now the Avatar. I need a four to charge you. Forward. Let's go deal with these riffraff. Death or oh, glory, Ford <laughs> Spire. <laughs> It's in. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Impact hits as I run into you. Take one. Uh-oh. <laughs> and then you take a morale test against that. Uh-oh. You lose another one. And then the Lineage Highborn also runs into you. Um, I did two to you, sir. <laughs> two more failures for you. Oh. Okay. Boom. Fantastic! And now we can test that objective. Actually, I think I control that objective. You do. Fun, I'm liking this. Your turn. You chose to move these guys first. I, don't I actually don't know why you move these guys up first. Maybe I've made a mistake. Uh, you might have. <laughs> a men at arms. Inspire clash. Oh, oh no. So I have two wounds left on that one. Four or less. Um, your mage looks like it hits twice. Just the once, clash one. Save against that. And I do, I fail it. Final test from that. I am down to one wound with this one guy at the end. You have to decay because I have aura of decay around me. One dice per stand. Unit itself, I'm okay, and on the character, takes a wound. So, my lineage highborn right uh -huh. here goes next. The draw event that she's gonna do is Pharaoh Override, which means uh, she gets to select a unit within six inches and they can do an extra clash action. Great. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the Leanish Highborn first because she's very excited about this. There's six attacks. Hitting on threes. I only got one. And they get four attacks each. I make my resolve on that. Uh, wow. One. This failed Whoa. dramatically. I should have been able to kill you. He's okay. And you save it. <laughs> no way. <laughs> wow. Well done, sir. Wow. That was. Uh... I was expecting. Way better than that. How did I only get two hits out of that many dice? Your dice finally caught up with you. Yeah, they did. They were going really <laughs> hot. That might save you the game. But it is not over yet because my avatar, screaming in frustration as you block all these hits with your shields and stuff like that, declares a dual action against your wizard. No. Ha! I'm broken, just like you. Ha 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 ha. My chapter mage! Hey, chapter mage! Fire knots to the face! Oh no, <laughs> this may have been a miscalculation. Okay, that's five. So I'm saving on twos for those five dice, and I got two of them. So three wounds, kills a stand, and does two damage to another one. So that means this is contested. So this is good. It does, it does make but a You also have there. to take three. Oh, I do have to take three morale tests from that. Right. Let's see what happens there. <laughs> Pish push. So I got one more. My brute drones. All right, so my brute drones are gonna come on right over here. They're gonna claim the objective and they're gonna hold it right here. They're ready. Okay. I still can't believe that unit survived. That unit should be dead like two times over. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> that is the end of this turn. I score one point for this objective here. Sure. No points for this because we can test it. I score one point. So I've got three points to your two points. Got two things that really need to go first. Because if I can go before you, before you can you probably rally, wipe out that unit. I can just, yeah, yeah, kill him. Now I can do my supremacy ability at the beginning of the turn, so I'll still be able to do that. Yep. Which means I will get to act with all three of the guys on the table. And if I get to go do that first. I'm in serious trouble. Fueled by pheromones, Nick has dashed across the map and surprised my forces. The frenzied first assault failed to break the human lines, but my fight to victory is uphill from here. 
Reinforcements, do my centaurs, come on. No! No! My centaurs have failed, come on. They will be punished later. <laughs> Just roll, see if your knights come in. Oh, that, yeah, I think they come in automatically, because they're medium. All right, this is important though. Hmm, what do I want to go first? So no bonus. The supremacy is huge. I want to go first. Supremacy! Do it! No! I am gonna do my supremacy ability, coordinated assault, because my guy's still alive. Oh, I'm so curious what your first move is. Oh, you're to to me! Yeah, that actually, I actually think that was a wise move. Fire darts! Oh, hit six. Oof. Oof. Ah. Um, so four go through. Oh, they're all safe. <sighs> Rough. Oh. <sighs> but now, my coordinated assault. So first, up the avatar. You know what? Because I'm almost dead anyways, I'm gonna burn out. I will inspire and then clash. I need a high bomb. Uh-oh. <laughs> Resolve test for that, sir. Bye-bye. But you know what I did take? That artifact. And I hold it and it seems to radiate mysterious energy. But I do have to do a burnout now. One. Oh. I took one. And Lini Chaiborn also has to possibly take damage, takes one as well. The beautiful thing is that I hold this objective. For now. You don't get to go yet. Force grown drones go next. Fire and clash because they only hit on ones otherwise. Stay broken. I'm gonna stay broken and risk you damaging me enough to kill me. On twos, there is <laughs> three. Save them all. <laughs> Maybe this is a bad choice. For the Warlord there, and I get three hits at cleave one. Resolve. Oh, there's another guy. Could have been better. All right, they're done. Then the Brute Drones. So I'm gonna shift to the side a little bit here, and then I'm gonna charge you. Yes. But you're still within my front arc. Probably won't do much, but I got one. Saves it. The more important thing I was doing here was tying you up. Pinning me down. My men at arms are dead. Excellent. Noble Lord. A noble Lord? A dual action with my Noble Lord. I'm gonna roll my dice now. I have hit you three times, X's. Saves one. Oh, that's pretty good. You're really, really dead. I did! <laughs> Reform the line. They are still broken. My go. Hey, look, the guy oh, is dead. He's dead. Yay. And look, the other guy says, precious, 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 precious. And he starts eyeing the avatar beside him. <laughs> I don't look at me. <laughs> Household guard, here is my glory. Just the two guys on the edge here are gonna fight the brutes. Everyone else going after this. So here's the two attacks from those guys. Uh, both hit. So on twos, got one. On ones! We got two ones! Resolve tests. Shattered, and they go, oh, I'm so scared! These sacred relics that they found here, and they realized that they were about to get killed, so they had to run away with them. So they're actually following orders. All going according to plan. I got nothing else. My knights. Oh, you need to contest that objective. I'm gonna take it from you. Hi, that's gonna actually pull me even. I get zero points this turn. You get a point for that, giving us a score of three to three. Five points wins the game. You almost had it. Tie game, and the stakes could not be higher. The arrival of the knights has steadied my lines, but Nick's cavalry is about to up the ante yet again. Turn five, let's do it. You kind of penned me in. You did, on purpose. My centaurs finally come on. So I only have a few cards left now. I'm ready. Supremacy, I really want to go first. Ooh, I'll tie it. <laughs> <laughs> you bumped my dice I there. I did too. I, it was gonna be a one. Oh. oh yeah. The dice gods have spoken. Oh no. Going first with the Avatara. Excellent. I'm gonna charge you. So give me charge. Hook. Get in there. Three impact hits. Got you twice. Two hits for the impact from the highborn. All good. And then one more. I'm good. But now inspired. I'm gonna hit you really hard. Avatara hits you four times. A cleave one. The highborn. Oh, that was terrible. 
Uh, take one. All right, for your result tests. Oh. I really like that I did that because I charged you, which means you don't get your impact hits. And uh, I bet you're going knights next, aren't you? Cheat. Yeah, it's the knights. <laughs> oh. Because if I charged you, then I'd be a full unit. Oh, but as yeah. it is, I'm all mucked up. And now if you don't kill me, we can test that objective. Yeah. You will not take my coin. On fours. Oh, you're dead. They're dead. The whole unit is wiped. Got him. Guess what's next? The Brute Drones. They are going to burn out. Okay. Because I need to reform the lines. Combat reform. They're good? Let's fight. Oh. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Wow. One, one failure. Die. 100 kingdoms, hold strong. Oh boy, that's oh, so bad. Oh, 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 that was so good. Oh no, oh no. Oh, the unit has been wiped. Nick has outpicked me, securing initiative across the board and destroying a key unit. Disheartened and distracted, I failed to fight with my noble lord before the brutes chased him from the field, laden with shame. Knights, you are my only hope. I had to burn out here. I did tip two damage. Ah! Your turn, sir. Dead dudes. <laughs> my turn. The uh, highborn, who's dead. The centaurs. The Centaur Avatara are coming on. And they're gonna move all the way to... So at the end of this turn, you will score one point, bringing you to four, and my three. Winning score is five. That's right. Well, I am finally in the lead. One point away from victory. Nick has commanding board presence and will score enough points to win next turn. My only hope is my knights can hold the center Avatara off and steal me a tie. But what a game. If I can pin you without getting you getting to my objective can, and hold on to yeah. mine, then I, we can have a tie game. I have two cards left. With Supremacy! Supremacy! Supremacy. Oh, oh, it's a tie! No, it's but not. You get to go. Oh, you get to go first! I get to go first. So I'm going to reform, and then it's a give me charge. Charge! This is so cool. You're now holding this objective, and you will score a point tying the game as long as I don't kill you. Impact hits. Two. I take one. I was the time. Where these guys move up. <laughs> and that was the time. Where I fight you back. Goodbye. I'm gonna inspire. Are oh, you gonna burn out too? I'm gonna, yes, I'm gonna burn out. They normally clash on three. They're inspired to clash on four. They're burning out to clash on fives. Oh. <laughs> 12 hits. I think you're gonna live and it's gonna be a tie game. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> I defeated you! Killed them all! The artifacts are recovered, and this sight of power will be held by the spire. All I got things, five points. All things said, That's I really still good. scored four points. And you almost tied it up. I almost did. What a fantastic game. It was Nick, fun. Your aggressive moves there were awesome. You have to play aggressive with the spire, I think. Yeah. I managed to play really tactically here, and I managed to make some good plays that I think outdid you. And you know what? That's what we've seen with all of our Conquest games, is they've all been really close games, regardless of how lucky or unlucky someone's rolled. I did my best and was bested. Thank, Thank you, you so Tyler. much, Nick. Thank you. And remember, if you want to support Plan um, or get interested in this game, you can find an affiliate link in the description below where you can purchase some of these amazing miniatures and join in the world of Conquest. Taiko has not decided to share with me where the story is going, but it, it might be something to do with these artifacts of the Old Dominion. We'll see. But, till next time. Play on. Play on. Ooh.